Chicago's West Side Preparatory School, located on the second floor of an old bank building, was founded as an antidote to what Marva Collins saw as the ineffectiveness of the public schools. I was always very upset with my own children who went to school reading when they were four. And to put them into a school where they threw blocks all day, they had a peanut butter sandwich, they went out for recess, and it was time to come home. Well, Judas Priest, I could do that at home. I could buy them a set of blocks that they could throw at each other. I'm afraid they don't need a teacher for that. Its students, ranging in age from 4 to 14, are challenged, pushed, prodded, and kept busy from the moment they walk in. It's a high-intensity, no-frills, firmness-with-affection approach to learning. There is no recess and no playtime. And what for pray? Said Make Legree. your voice ask a question. Okay, and what for pray? Very good. Said Legree. Students here read historical novels in the classics instead of simple texts. The results have been startling. No discipline problem, accelerated reading and writing skills, and appreciation of good literature far beyond the students' years. I like John Steinbeck, Aesop, um, Charles Dickens. The former Chicago public school teacher started the school on a shoestring with 28 pupils. Now there are 200 and a long waiting list. The tuition is $80 a month, but only for those who can afford to pay.